On this day in Southern labor history, May 25th, 1941, Silas Norman was born. Silas Norman was a civil rights activist and leading organizer of the Student Nonviolent Coordinating Committee, SNCC. While a student at Payne College in Augusta, Georgia in 1960, Norman was instrumental in organizing the sit-in movement that led to the desegregation of downtown Augusta, along with the outlawing of segregated buses in the entire state of Georgia. In 1963, Norman moved to Alabama to help work on SNCC's adult literacy campaign in Selma. The project was aimed at empowering working class residents in Alabama's Black Belt counties to pass the state's voter registration test that had been used to restrict the right to vote. Shortly after the passage of the Civil Rights Act in 1964, Norman and other SNCC staff decided to test Alabama's compliance with it by sitting down in a downtown restaurant. Within minutes, Norman was arrested by the local sheriff. After hearing the news of the arrest, hundreds of high school students and youth staged sit-ins all around the city in defense of the jailed literacy project workers. After his release from jail, Silas Norman became director of SNCC's Alabama Project. He spent the next several years expanding voting rights and literacy campaigns throughout the poorest counties of Alabama. Throughout his time in the organization, he played an important role in the many efforts and debates that shaped the legacy of SNCC and the civil rights movement as a whole.